you're bringing a lot of people onto a film set, which is an alien environment to them. And because they're writing the check, they are given some sort of right to participate or approve of what's happening. But because they are there on that day and they are paying, they are fully, fully entitled in their minds to tell you how to light, to tell you how to block, to tell you how to talk to the actors. It makes for a very challenging thing. It took me a while to learn how to protect the actors. I was shooting a, a, a laxative commercial and I'm working with a Broadway, a woman who's just won the Tony, incredibly talented woman. And she's taken a monologue about constipation and she's just made it amazing. So we shoot about 15 takes and I think, yeah, you know, this is great, we're done. And the writer suddenly is, appears next to me. He looks very unhappy. And I said, what's, what's the problem? He said, she doesn't get peristalsis. Peristalsis is a scientific term for taking a dump. I said, she seriously gets that. I know she does. He goes, no. She's not getting that. I don't hear it in her voice. And I said, I said, what do you want to do about that? He said, somebody's got to explain peristalsis to her. So I said, well, listen, that's not going to be me. And he goes, fine, I'll talk to the actress. So the guy goes over and spends his five minutes of importance embarrassing himself. I go over to the actress and I say, I'm really sorry. And she won't even make eye contact with me. But what I learned was that I needed to protect the actors because that was going to happen every time. Even as I got to be more and more were successful and people gave me a lot more freedom, there was still always a point in the day when something dumb would happen. Otherwise, I'd have no fucking book.